it seems like through the '90s, you know, it, it it's much of the same. You, you're acquiring businesses. Devon is growing, and then you come to 2001. You get a phone call from the Oklahoma Hall of Fame, and they are inducting you in the Oklahoma Hall of Fame in 2001. Did you feel like you'd arrived at that point? Was I, that a shock? I was shocked. Yeah. Uh, I felt, and I've heard others say the same thing. Well, that's nice, but only old people get that. I'm much too young to get that. You were 49 <laughs> you know, at the time, I, right? I, I don't know. Do yeah. you know how old I was? Uh, six, what have it been? 59. Yeah. Right, 42. Whatever. Yeah. Whenever it was, you're sure. always yeah. much too old. I think um, I'm terrible at math, but I'd assume 59. Yeah. yeah. Um, I've really forgotten, but that was my... Yeah. You, know, you have simultaneous reactions. One, you're, of course, flattered and honored. You're embarrassed because you don't really deserve it. Yeah. And you're thinking, I'm, I'm not old enough to get this. Only old people get this. Right. God, I'm maybe getting old. <laughs> maybe I should retire. <laughs> well, who, uh, who introduced you that day when you got your, uh, when you're on stage and who introduced you as, you know, was it the same back then as it was not as it is today? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Um, a, a person who was the chairman of uh, Baker Hughes, a company that I was on the board of, mm-hmm. I'd asked Bill Rehnquist, uh, yeah. the chief justice, then the chief justice of the Supreme Court, yeah. uh, but it was in the middle of the court session and he couldn't do it. Yeah. Um, 